Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, I'm Shanice and welcome to Simply Nikla. A few weeks ago, I bought some dresses and now I'm about to show you all of them and, you know, rate them because that's what people do when they do a try on haul. So if you're interested and ready to see what I have gotten, go ahead, sit back, relax, and continue watching. But before you do, and if you want to subscribe, subscribe to my YouTube channel, give my video a like as well. But other than that, let's get started with this video. And I can wait so we can break apart the so this try on haul is from the company Shein and I never have before now bought anything from Shein so I decided to jump on there and see what they have. When I got on there they have a lot of cheap things and a lot of cute things and that was just dangerous all combined in one because I got a lot of dresses. So I have all kinds of Shein stuff and specifically Shein dresses to wear this summer. So let's get into it. The first dress that I tried on is this green dress with small little flowers. So I picked this dress because I don't have any green dresses right now in my dress collection, should I say. So, and it was really, really cute. And so combined those two, I had to buy it. And so I really love how this dress really fits on me. And since I'm a short, only five foot, I love the length on me. And I really love that elastic empire waist style. I think it looks cute. And I love like the square neckline. And I love the ruffle sleeves. I just love those sleeves so much. The only con about this dress, it's kind of baggy. I got an extra large because you know to go around all of me I need that extra large and so parts of this dress and different dresses that I'm gonna show maybe a little bit too baggy that's what this dress in the back is kind of a little baggy but it's all still good and so if I would rate this dress I would say an 8 out of 10 since it's a little bit of bagginess I will still give it a 8 out of 10 still a good dress and I still love it and I still will wear it so the next dress that I'm going to show you guys is this one that I have on right now in this video it's this leopard print dress so I picked this dress because on the model on the website it was so freaking cute and it was also cheap so those two again it's just I had to get it so I love the fit on me and it, was, it looks really cute on me uh, I love the print as well I don't have any like leopard print things so I love the print I love the bow on the back that you had to tie yourself I just love that and I love the high neckline and this halter top sleeve area I just love the shape of it and I don't have like a dress like this so course I needed to get it and I glad I got it the only con with this dress is kind of baggy again around the sleeve halter top area around the chesticles and kind of like bulges out around the armpit area so what should I score this dress rate this dress and I say I still give this dress a 8 out of 10 the next dress is this light blue floral dress and so I picked this dress because I love the color and I love the floral design on this dress as well and I really loved how it looked on the model on the model it looked like it was more cinched in and or had some kind of cinched in this on the model but it's really loose fitting and it fits nice but baggy and there's a lot of room in this dress so I just love it like that it's a lot of room which wasn't really noticeable on the model of how bagginess it was maybe it's just because the different size who knows and I really love and think it's different how that that triangle cut out at the neckline I really love that little bits right there only con I would say I wish it was just a little bit more fitting not too much but just a little bit or somewhere like cinched in a little bit I will rate this one about a 6.5 to 7 out of 10 with this dress so yeah what would you rate this dress I mean the next dress that I have bought was this tie-dye dress for one I picked this dress because it was a tie-dye and I never had a tie-dye dress so I really needed to get this one especially on Shein they had oh, tons tons of tie-dye type of dresses and I really love this one I really love the fit on me I like how it just 
hugs all the right things on my body and I love the tie-dye design and the colors is not typical type of colors like the brown and orange I just love that tie-dyeness on this dress and I love how it's just a little hint of ruffleness detail around the sleeves and around the neckline I just love that so much and once again I just love the length of this dress there wasn't any really cons to this dress and it's really stretchy and just it's just it's just beautiful so i will rate this tie-dye dress a nine out of ten yes a nine so next i got this blue blackish floral dress it's really like a dark blue so i picked this dress because i thought it was just too darn cute to pass up i really love the neckline and that little triangle peekaboo around the chesticle area i really love the floor design obviously it's a little different than the last one and i still love it and i love the length on me i love how it really fits and complements my body shape i think i look really good in this dress not to hoot my horn but i do and i look a little mature like a mature and so i really like that so what did i rate this one in a distance, I will rate this dress a 9.5 out of 10, but close up, I would say an 8 or a 9 out of 10. Like, yes, I love this. The next dress that I've got is this 90s baby girl dress. That's what it's called, baby girl 90s dress for one. I picked this dress up because I am a 90s girl. Um, I was born in 93. I'm a 90s baby, so I had to get this right. And I just love the nickname Baby Girl. This dress is just like a really simple black form-fitting like t-shirt, tank toppy, fabric kind of dress. And I just love the length on me. But it's a little too form-fitting, a little tight around the belly area, but I can fix it. So the major con to this dress though, okay it's a thick as crap you might not see it through this video but it's thick and in this hot heat summer heat in missouri especially it's 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 a little, a little too much and it's thick and you're gonna be sweating all the time but i still love it though and i still wear it and so i rate this a 7.5 out of 10 because it's too darn thick and it's hot but it's still wearable so yeah that's why i would rate it <laughs> so the last dress that I bought from Shein is this, I, I, I call it the plaid overall dress because it has that overallness, you'll see. So I picked this dress up because it's unusual. Um, I don't have a dress like this in my collection and I look great online on the model, obviously, like every dress does. So just for your information, if you want to get this dress, it doesn't come with the t-shirt the black t-shirt because that if that t-shirt's mine it's just the plaidness that's only what it comes with so i picked this dress up because i love the plaid i don't have a plaid dress either so that's great even though this is kind of like a half plaid dress basically i love the style it has an overall look to it shape and it's like it stops on your chest and then it has like the strap bow tight bow tight on your shoulders and I also love like the little small slit in the dress like I just love that and it just hugs to my body like I love it I love the length as well the con to this dress is a little too fitting um a little bit but it's still cute enough that I can keep it and I can fix it later and so it looks more better onto my butt hey. so for the plaid dress I rate this online 10 out of 10 and on me it'll be like a solid you know six maybe seven out of ten um maybe even stretch it at 7.2 okay i'm stretching it so you guys that is my shein try on haul dress edition so i hope you like this little video um i love this little haul video i really had a grand time to buying them wearing them trying them on for you guys but anyway Thank you so much for watching this video. Go down below and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Like this video if you liked the video. But other than that, I'll catch you back next week with another video. Bye.